Prince Harry mad with rage as he's removed from Harper's Bazaar hottest men list after vast public outrage. Headlines about the British royal family are always plentiful. But this time, Prince Harry is at the center of a big controversy. He was ranked 25th on Harper's Bazaar's hottest men list, but was suddenly removed. This move has left fans and critics in shock. Why did public opinion lead to such a drastic move? And how is Prince Harry handling this unexpected blow to his status as a style icon? Let's explore the twists and turns of this surprising saga. The controversy that set the internet on fire. Imagine scrolling through your social media and finding Prince Harry on Harper's Bazaar's hottest men list. He was ranked 25th, and the world seemed to agree. His rugged charm and ginger beard made him a favorite among royal watches. But the celebration was short-lived. Just days later, public opinion turned, and Harry was removed from the list. People were confused, outraged, and fascinated by the whole thing. So, what caused this public outrage? How could someone so admired for his looks, personality, and charitable work suddenly face backlash? The public outrage. Was it about looks, politics, or something else? Public outrage is rarely simple, and this case was messy. Some said Prince Harry's inclusion was about his royal title, not his looks. Others believed his removal was a backlash against him for stepping down from royal duties with Meghan Markle. But shouldn't the hottest men list be about physical appeal? Or does the public think more holistically, considering personality, public behavior, and politics? Could Harry's exit from royal duties and his interviews criticizing the royal family have overshadowed his status as a heartthrob? Many think so. But while public opinion can be fickle, one thing is clear. Harry's departure from this list is more complicated than a bad hair day. <clears throat> from royal heartthrob to public villain? How Harry's public image has shifted. Prince Harry was once the bad boy of the royal family. He partied hard, broke traditions, and lived a life free from the monarchy's stuffiness. And people loved him for it. But the Harry of today is different. After marrying Meghan Markle, they stepped away from royal life due to mental health struggles and media harassment. In interviews, Harry has been candid about the strain of royal life and the lack of support from his family. To many, Harry is a hero for speaking his truth and protecting his family. To others, he has betrayed his duty and sullied the monarchy's image. This division has followed him in nearly every aspect of public life. Did the weight of public scrutiny tip the scales against Prince Harry? His removal from the list might show a change in how we see him. Why do we care so much about who's on these lists? <clears throat> Celebrity culture. Why we care about who's hot and who's not. At first glance, a hottest men list seems trivial. But these lists shape how we see public figures. They are more than just vanity. Being named one of the hottest men is about influence and cultural standing. Prince Harry's removal shows a deeper change in public opinion. It's not just about looks. We love to build celebrities up and then tear them down. It's part of the celebrity cycle. Harry's removal from the list is symbolic of his challenges in maintaining his image. But what does this mean for his future? Will Harry regain his status as a global heartthrob? Or has this outrage marked a permanent change in how he's seen? The role of social media in shaping celebrity status. Social media has become the ultimate influencer in celebrity status. Public opinion is now shaped by likes, shares, and comments on our timelines. This is true for Prince Harry's case. The public outrage that led to his removal was driven by social media. Thousands of people voiced their discontent, causing Harper's Bazaar to reconsider his inclusion. Social media's power is undeniable. One viral tweet can change a conversation. In Prince Harry's case, it seems to have done just that. But is this fair? Should someone's status be determined by public opinion on social media? <clears throat> From prince to philanthropist, can Harry reclaim his status? Prince Harry is more than just a pretty face. His work in mental health, veterans' issues, and climate change has earned him respect. But can that restore his status? Does Harry need to be on a hottest men list to maintain his influence? Or is his true power in connecting with people on deeper levels? Being hot is about more than just looks. Perhaps this episode shows that being hot is about standing up for what you believe in. It's about challenging the status quo. In that sense, Prince Harry may be hotter than ever. <clears throat> the takeaway, what this drama tells us about our own obsession with celebrity. Prince Harry's removal from the list is more than gossip. It shows our complex relationship with celebrity. We constantly judge public figures against changing standards. 
But maybe it's time to rethink our obsession with these lists. Beauty is in the eye of the beholder. In a world where social media can change someone's reputation overnight, let's focus on what truly makes someone a role model. <clears throat> Call to action. What's your take? Now it's your turn. What do you think about Prince Harry's removal from Harper's Bazaar's hottest men list? Was it fair? Or did public opinion go too far? Share your thoughts in the comments below and join the conversation. And if you found this article thought-provoking, why not share it with your friends and see what they think? After all, this is one debate that's far from over. Why Harry's removal highlights a bigger problem, celebrity versus substance. Prince Harry's removal from Harper's Bazaar's hottest men list shows how fast public opinion can change. But it also makes us think about our society's focus on looks versus substance. The debate isn't just about Harry's place on the list. It's about our culture valuing looks over meaningful contributions. In today's world, we often judge celebrities by their looks, ignoring their important work. Harry has spoken out on mental health, veterans, and social justice. Yet, his looks and royal status still overshadow his real contributions. What does this say about us? Are we more interested in how someone looks than in their causes? And if so, what does this mean for celebrity culture? <sighs> Rethinking what makes someone hot, the shift toward inner beauty. It's time to rethink what makes someone hot in public figures. The most attractive qualities often go beyond looks. Traits like integrity, courage, and kindness are what truly makes someone stand out. Prince Harry's work on mental health and philanthropy has inspired many. Yet, his removal from the hottest men list shows we still struggle to value inequalities over looks. Could this be the heart of the controversy? This debate is crucial, given our era's emphasis on substance over style. Shouldn't lists like Harper's Bazaars consider a person's character and contributions, not just looks? This controversy might just wake us up to reevaluate celebrity and what truly makes someone hot. <sighs> the changing face of masculinity. What modern men can learn from Prince Harry. Prince Harry represents the changing definition of modern masculinity. Today, qualities like vulnerability, emotional intelligence, and empathy are valued in men. Harry has shown all these qualities. His openness about mental health and royal pressures has made him relatable. Yet, his removal from a hottest men list might suggest society still struggles with these qualities. For men, this controversy offers a chance to reflect on evolving masculinity ideals. So, is this list removal a blow to Harry's reputation? Or is it a reflection of the challenges of breaking free from traditional masculinity? In a world changing its expectations for men, Harry's journey offers a valuable lesson for all. The Harry Effect Will this hurt his public image, or is he unstoppable? For most public figures, being removed from a prestigious list might be a turning point. But Prince Harry isn't most public figures. Despite controversies, he has a loyal following, admired for his break from tradition and his boldness. Will this list removal affect Harry's public image in the long run? Or is it just a small setback in his successful rebranding as a modern, relatable figure? Harry's charm comes from connecting with people deeply. He talks openly about his mental health and supports veterans. These qualities can't be erased by a list. Being left off a hottest men list might make him even more appealing. There's something attractive about a man who challenges the norm. <clears throat> Can public outrage over Harry's removal change how we view rankings? Prince Harry's removal from the hottest men list has caused outrage. This could be a chance to rethink how these lists are made. Shouldn't we value more than just looks? What if we looked at what truly makes someone attractive? Could Harry's contributions to society be as important as his looks? This controversy might show we're ready for a change. In a world that values inclusivity, shouldn't our idea of beauty change too? <sighs> Wrapping up, a royal rebound on the horizon? Prince Harry's removal from the list is just a part of his story. It's a setback, but it won't define him. Harry has shown he can bounce back from criticism. As he continues his work in life with Meghan Markle, Harry will keep grabbing attention. Whether he's on future lists or not, his story is far from over. <clears throat> Call to action. What's your definition of hot? Now it's your turn to share your thoughts on Harry's removal. Do you think it was right? Or was the outrage unfair? What makes someone truly hot to you? Leave your comments below and start the conversation. If you enjoyed this article, share it with your friends. Let's talk about what really matters.